Hello, my name is Alan Pecor, and in this lesson, we are going to learn how to charge both the ground control station modem and the batteries for the Siestro Bramor PPX. Shown here is the Ultra Dual Plus. This is the charging station that Siestro provides. To help acquaint yourself with this system, be sure you can identify the charging cables, the balance boards, the 5,500 milliamp hour battery, and the ground control station modem. Before charging the modem, be sure to check that its port is free of corrosion and that the antenna is tightened in place. Once you determine that the ground control station is suitable for charging, plug in the charging station and the monitors will turn blue. By pressing down on the output select button, you can focus your charging settings on monitor one or monitor two. In this lesson, we are going to charge the ground control station modem on channel 1, so it makes sense to use monitor 1. As spelled out on the following slides, you will use both the dial and the output select button to navigate through the different pages that are on each monitor. Taking a closer look, monitor 1 is on memory page 0, as displayed by the page indicator. To move to a different page, rotate the dial. To access the memory select settings, press the dial. Next, rotate the dial until you are on channel 3 and make sure that it says NIMH 12.0 volts at 2500 milliamp hours. Press escape and plug in the ground control station modem. Looking back at monitor 1, rotate the dial to page 1. Confirm that the screen says 12.0 volts at 2500 milliamp hours and press the dial to begin charging the ground control station. The monitor will confirm that the battery is charging. Next, we are going to charge the battery. At this point, the ground control station modem is charging, so we are going to use the settings on monitor 2. To access monitor 2, press the output select button and rotate the dial to the memory settings. You will then press the dial to access the memory select settings. Since this is a battery charge, confirm the settings are 14.8 volts at 11,000 milliamp hours. Now, you are going to connect the battery to the balance board and the charging cable. Remember, the balance connector plugs into the 4S port first, and then you plug in the Dean's connector. After plugging the battery in, rotate the dial to channel 1. Make sure that the screen displays 14.8 volts at 11,000 milliamp hours. Press the dial to charge the battery and see the screen confirm that the battery is charging. To recap the battery charging process, refer to the following clip. By viewing this tutorial, you should now know how to charge both the ground control station modem as well as the batteries for the Siestro Bramor PPX. 
For more complex trading material, refer to my online portfolio or you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.